Intercoin, bringing power to the people. I, I think it's important that, that we recognize that so much of the crime we see around us is due to uh, both lack of income uh, via poverty. Uh, women in blockchain talks is all about spotlighting the women in the industry and they are encouraging them, encouraging, we are encouraging more women to come into this spotlight or limelight. Blockchain is NFTs. And for me, it was how do we solve a problem, you know, with these technologies? How do we enhance human experiences? How do we look at how we start to humanize technology? And, you know, started Voltil, you know. But for us, it's it's around the human centricity. The way that you, like, develop business, like, government clients is not by just, like, posting an ad in The Economist. It's by, like, networking and getting to know them having meetings or whatever. We have developed the blockchain business trends, which started as a group on LinkedIn. And the objective is to have a community of decision makers that are involved in the Web3 space together, and we'll be able to provide resources, information, tools as we evolve to this community. We support innocent, mistreated, vulnerable and abused people with a strong passion to see children highly educated, safely and comfortably sheltered and healthily fed. We currently support 13 organisations, it's 12 orphanages and one school. Like to be the first to hear about Intercoin's roadmap and news? Definitely join and subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to click that little notification button so you can get updates when the next video drops. And the next time we interview a legend like Noam Chomsky or Patrick Friedman. And if you would like to participate in the conversation, go to community.intercoin.app. We'd love to hear from you and about your community. This is what the project is all about. Intercoin, bringing power to the people.